Do you have peace? Do you have love? Do you have faith? Do you have grace today? Do you have those things? If the answer is yes, then I would exhort you, give it away. God's calling you today through his word to be a friend to other people, to actively to engage and understand my role is to be a faithful friend to somebody else. Just as Paul had Tychicus, who am I being faithfully, a faithful friend to? And if the answer is no, I want to say a few things to you. First of all, if, if you don't have the peace and the love of God and his, his grace and you don't have that faith, I want to ask you where you stand with the Lord Jesus Christ. Because if today you say, man, those things all sound great. Why, why is it years ago that cheers are so, so popular and the song so popular where everybody knows your name? That's what everybody longs for. They just want to belong. That's why, that's why gangs are so, so prevalent and so you know, successful. People just want a place to belong. And, and so, so the, the, the issue here is that, man, if you are, are saying, well, Pastor Ted, that's, that sounds amazing. I would love to be able to have all those things. I would tell you today, you can have all those things. And we're going to pray, and I'm going to give you an invitation. If you don't know the Lord Jesus Christ, and you haven't known that kind of fellowship, you haven't known that kind of relationship, it's available to you. It starts with a relationship with Jesus. And it's not a relationship that you earn by doing good and trying harder. It's a relationship that, that, that you enjoy simply by receiving God's free gift. Jesus' death on the cross in your place for your sin. And so I'll give you an opportunity to receive Christ as we pray, and I exhort you to do that. And if you say, hey, look, I've done that, but I still lack those things, then I would say, look, you need to take some steps to, to, to make a friend and to engage with people, whether it's getting plugged into a growth group, whether it's doing what Jesus commanded and doing unto others as you would have them do unto you. You need to take the step to do that.